Hello friends, this video on relations and functions part 18 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 17. Now we will discuss different kind of functions. There are three different kind of functions. One is 1-1, one, one. the next is onto and the third is 1-1 one, one and onto. So, 1-1 one, one function is also called injective, onto function is also called surjective and the function that is both 101 and onto is called bijective. I will give you some tips to remember this. Just now try to memorize this that you have three kind of functions 11 onto and the third one is the one which is both 11 and onto. 11 is called injective, onto is called surjective, 11 and onto is called bijective function. Now let us discuss function 11 that is injective in details. So what does 11 function? A function f x to y is defined to be 1 1 or injective if the image of distinct element of x are distinct. That is for every x1 x2, this x1 x2, this implies x1 is equal to x2. So this is image, this is all the image part and this is the input part or you can say this is output also if you can say because if you say f of 1 that becomes a. This is a function it implies, this implies f of 1 is equal to a because the moment you give 1 as input you get a as output. f of 2 is b. Why? Because if you give 2 as input you get b as output. Similarly f of 3 will be d. Why? Because if you give 3 as input you get d as output and f of 4 is equal to c. The same thing is represented in this fashion here. This is the input and this is the image or output. So a function is said to be 101 if for every input there is a distinct image. You can't have two different input having same image. One input will have one distinct image. Correct. I will give you one example of function that is not 101 also to make things clear. But now understand that every input has one image, distinct image. We will take one more example. This function if you see, you give 1 as input, you get B as image. You give 2 as input, you get C as image. 3, you get A, 4, D. If you see right, every input has a distinct image. Such kind of function is 1 over. Here also if you see, if you give F of 1 in this function, you get B. You give F of 2, you get C. You give F of 3, you get A. And you give F of 4, you get D. You see all are distinct. B, C, A, D. Here also A, B, D, C. All are distinct. Such kind of function is called 1, 1 function. That is injective function. I will give you one example of function that is not 1, 1 and that is called mini 1 function. Function that is not 1, 1 is called mini 1 function. Obviously, complement of that. One example is this. If you see right, if you give input as 1, you get output as B. If you give input as 2 also, you get output as B only. So if you see this here in this case, f of 1 is equal to b, f of 2 is also equal to b, f of 3 is here c and f of 4 is d. So if you see the output are not distinct, they are two values 1 and 2 which share the same output. Such kind of function is called not 1 over 1, that is called many 1 function. Correct. So what we have seen? In case of 101 function, these outputs, these are all distinct, distinct for 101 and not distinct, not distinct for many one function, right? So there are two kind of function. If you see, the function will be either 101 or many one. If it is many one, that means many input will have same output. If it is 101 that means one input will have one output only. This is the difference. Now the memory tip why it is injective. So if you see the injection just, just memorize injection which you have uh, that uh, you take in your hands. This injection just understand that at a given hole only one injection can 
fit in. Correct? Because you can't have two injection at a given point. So that means if let's suppose this is a hole, V is a hole, if at this point two values are coming, right? Two needles are coming, this is not injected. But if for all the values, only one intels are coming. For example, uh, the one we saw in the last slide, we have this function where uh, there's one one mapping. This is let's suppose one, two, three. This is A, B, C. At all the point, if you see right, there's only one needle coming, only one injection coming. Correct? Then it is called injective. This is just a way to remember, not it doesn't have any mathematical relevance, just a memory to remember because injective from injective you uh, can memorize injective is similar to injection and if you can see that in a hole you can have only one injection one injection per hole one injection per hole so if we have this fund of one injection per hole in that case if this is the hole A if it has one injection if the hole B has one injection if the hole C has one injection all the holes have one injection then it is one one that is one injection per hole if many injections are coming to one hole example in this scenario for example two injections are coming in this hole b so it is many one just a memory to remember so i have defined what is one one function thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials study from the best tutors and mentors and much more Thanks once again.